Hi, it's Dan from Bokane Designs, and in today's video, I'm going to show you how to use Yoast SEO's bulk tag editor. So, I've already installed Yoast SEO on this website. Here it is on the left. I'm going to go over here and click Tools. And then I'm going to click Bulk Editor. And this is going to bring us to an interface where we can see every single piece of content that's published, or even in draft form, or even in our trash on the website. And it's going to let you change either the title tag or the meta description tag. And this way you don't have to go through every single page and product and edit them manually. You can do them in groups of 10 here. Um, so sometimes you'll have an SEO do keyword research or write a bunch of tags for you and then tell you you need to put them on your website or they'll tell you how much it costs to put it on your website. Um, and if you have the ability to do it yourself, sometimes they'll let you. Um, on the off chance that's your situation or maybe you've done your own keyword research and you know what title tags you want to use, this is a great way for updating your titles quickly. Um, so what you'll do is you come here to the screen and then you can pick what kind of content you want to show. So on this website we have pages, we have blog posts, and we have products. So let's go ahead and go to products and we'll click filter. Now this is going to show us just the products. So it won't have all the pages, so it's showing 199 items total. That's how many products we have on the site. Um, and then it's showing us if there's already a title tag defined or if it's not defined in this column, like you haven't entered something yet, this is what it's using by default. So you'll put your new title here and then you click save. And just for the sake of this video, we're going to go ahead and take part of the title over here, but if you had it from a spreadsheet from your SEO, you would copy it and then paste a new title here. I'm just populating these a little bit. And then you can either click save and you'll see right away it shows up here and that's done. Now we're done. Like You, you don't have to save anywhere else. There's no save button at the bottom like there are sometimes. Um, that page now has this as a title tag. And then if you want to do a few at once, you can technically populate all these boxes. And I'm just, for the sake of the simplicity of making the video, taking what we have over here on the left and just putting it over here on the right. You would want to use your actual keywords from whoever did keyword research. But once you've populated the boxes you want to update, so I've updated five more, click Save All on any of these links, and then they'll all be saved quickly. Um, so one click. So it's it's nice if you have a bunch of tags and do one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and then click save all, and then you can go on to page two. And you would complete them again on page two, click save all. In my case, there's 20 pages to go through. But this is much faster than the alternative, which would be going to products. And then when you get to products, you would have to go into the actual product editor. And then you come down to the Yoast SEO box and put your title tag here and your meta description here. And then you have to come up here and click update. And imagine doing that 200 times versus going to that sheet where you just copy paste, copy paste, copy paste 10 times, click save all, click next page. Uh, so you can see why the Yoast SEO bulk editor is worth your time. It's very easy to use. A lot of WordPress websites use Yoast SEO already. And it does let you also do the meta description in a very similar way. I'll show you real quick. We go at the top and click description. And now you see it's the Yoast meta description tag. You would type in your unique content there. Or if you don't really have content and you just want something there, maybe your page, your product page or something has text you'd want to use. Um, it's not recommended just to put random product text as a meta description. You usually want it to be a little more tailored to someone who's on a search engine, but just to show you how it works, we put our text in that box, we click save, and just like the title tag, it populates the same way. And now that page has a unique title tag, so we did that on the tab up here, and now it has a unique meta description as well. Let me know if you have any questions. Thank you.